What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back, and we are ready to clappeth the cheeks with Benita. So, a couple things. Um, when we do our swap between, this isn't actually health regen. After looking more into it, I discovered it's stamina regen, meaning she is a king of R1. So, just take a look at my stamina regen right now. Now, we'll go through a pretty long combo. You know, that's, that's a decent rate. It's not, not too fast, not too slow. When I have this up, now I'll take a look at the stamina. Zoop. Not only that, but when we use this shield thing, the shield will decrease instead of our health. So basically, this character is just freaking nuts. Um, after discovering that, I went in and was like, all right, well, I like this a lot, so let's go. Um, so we already had counter. I did this. I used I used both my crystals on her. Uh, so my holy soul, my shield is up by 100%. Um, the duration on my stamina regen. Because so I was sitting there and I was like, provided by Wind Whisper. I was like, this move is not called Wind Whisper. But it's it's just a mistranslation. You know, they didn't, they didn't put it properly. We don't regen health. We have stamina. Um, and then as for getting health back, if we want, we can rip our health back via this with touch of whip so i went ahead did another crystal there boosted that by six seconds so that when we do touch of whip we are just going to town with it uh, also went ahead and grabbed uh, the basic stuff and alchemy insanity uh, but basically yeah yeah benita is really good she's really really good um i need to level up my the amount of elixirs i have next but anyway uh so from here we we kind of came down this path uh, and there's a lot that we can we can go do I mean, a lot of high areas, but let's uh I want to kill this guy that's above me. I need to figure out where I want to go first. And I also don't trust water anymore. <laughs> I get a backstab on you. Oh God. Oh, come on, Benita, get out. No, no, I'm stuck. Oh, no, not what I want. Yeah, so ideally, I'm not sure. The only thing I'm not sure about is my my like elixirs. So, like when I when I pop this, that's gone. You know, I have my shield, but I think I only get like four uses of this. I'm not exactly sure how it works. Like I don't think I, that meter ever builds back up. I don't know though. Because she has uh, over over here an alchemy. There's um, where is it at? Here's the duration of buffs. That's potions, health potions. Which was it over in special? Maybe I remember there was a thing for her elixirs. Yeah, here we go. Increase the maximum number of elixirs that can be held. Um, and then execution and backstab can replenish. So I think I need to get those. And then I think that way, because I think I start with four elixirs and that is max. And like once they're gone, they're gone. But the elixirs is how I can get my shield, my crazy stamina regen, all that goodness. Ooh, hang on. Is this is this safe? I have I have trust issues when it comes to water now. Yeah, that was close. 
Mastodon bones. I feel like I'm not getting bones a lot. And I wonder if it's because maybe... Do these, can I stack the, these to like ramp up the effect? I wonder if Anzathon bones drop more often when I have on... Uh, when my sanity is low. I feel like my sanity doesn't get low a lot in regular progressive combat, only in boss fights. So yeah, we can need to work our way around and there's probably a shortcut we'll kick down. This one's not that hostile. Strange. Are there still normal people here in Pity? Or just people who look normal? Wait, one of you is trying to hide, but I can- A talking sunflower? <laughs> I just survived things. I used to be a priest of the church, with flesh and bones, but that was a long time ago. Nowadays, it is quite strange to stay in the form of a human. The mist there is not the same as the Sandros. <sighs> Those are just the little tricks of the Martians. Here are some tips. The Martians believe in the eternal flow of life. The past, the present, and the afterlife. Only by experiencing the three lives can you find the truth. Alright, that tip didn't really tell me anything. Unless it's a... Oh, yeah, it's a play on words. I need to actually find three stones. So that's the present, and I gotta go find a past and a future stone. seen a lot of ants and the bones dropping when my abnormality hit. Oh, bro. The only thing is her defense is like non-existent. So when I do get hit. Check all of this lower area first, and then I'll work my way up top. Because I'm pretty sure I can drop there and do whatever's up there. There's stuff up there. It's a path. That's a big boy. 
Um, <laughs> Chloe. <sighs> Courier. We'll meet again. Steal nothing. Indeed. It's not a trivial matter. Sometimes even the lucky. The hourglass must be behind. Okay. Um. Oh, you know what? Before I do that. Sure, I can go up here. Oh, hedgy, cool. I'm gonna plunge and smash this thing. Uh, gold hedgies don't like health potions. What about bones? You like bones, do you? See what's over here. I'm thinking there might be a shortcut back or something. Or no. Uh, well, actually, no. Wait. Yeah, Lost Valley is good. Because even if I die here, I get full health, and this is considered like a spawn point. Give me the crystals. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, shit. Is that all? Just that one chest? Is there another one over here? No, just the one. And that's a diamond. That's the first diamond. I figured I was going to get crystals. But I would gladly take a diamond. And I only had to lose the 38 bones. Because um, I'd given a bunch to the hedgy already. Not a bad deal. Uh, which I can now, we will swap. Give me the shield. Oh no. I tried to do like a falling heavy attack that did not work. Oh my god, this guy is not messing around. This is this is one of the times where I'd want to have sanction. Oh, Christ. I really, there's gotta be a, uh... Ooh, raw stone. Alright, well, thank you, Mr. Sunflower. If it wasn't for you attacking me, I never would have noticed. I need to be careful, though. All of this, the poison shots and whatnot coming down. I mean, it's not that far back, but no, there is a fair amount of bullshit I've already fought past. I want to continue on. I think everything respawned when I...
I like how Terrence, I can just... I can count on him to... to be consistent. Oh. And I build up a lot of, uh, a lot of fury on him. Kinds of goodies. Nope. Nope. I'm dead. Oh my god. Saved by the ledge. And dead. Damn it. <laughs> Gravity in this game does not mess around, dude. Death is the end. Death is palin palingenesis. Palin. Genesis. What is palingenesis? Palingenesis, the exact reproduction of ancestral characteristics and ontogenesis. I have no fucking idea what that means. Oh, here we go. Palingenesis is a concept of rebirth or recreation used in various contexts in philosophy, theology, politics, and biology. Its meaning stems from Greek. Palin meaning again, and Genesis meaning birth. So death is the end, death is being born again. Is this where... Oh, hell yes, it is. Okay. You know, I'm starting to... The, the whole idea of like... Hey, when you die, instead of losing all your shit... Um, you know, we're just going to take a, th a third of what you're carrying. That's really growing on me. Like, I'm really beginning to be like, oh, yeah, you know, just a third of my soul's shit. Oh, well. And then respawn back right back where I was. I'm, I'm digging it. Move. Gotta go fast. Drop down. Let's see where this leads. That guy respawns. I think this leads right up to where I was just going. Argol didn't. Didn't my current character need Argol? Nice, just right up top, yep. Drop down to fight them or continue along. Let's kick this down. Ooh, baby. So that's the first, that's the first swing. Heavy attack, light attack, and it said it would function as a dodge, which I- it's exactly what that did. Would've knocked me, or uh, would've just pushed me all the way back. If I die- oh no, that's- okay, so this is right near him. Grab... Um, let me drop, get you... I think I can use my shield to um, absorb fall damage there, it looked like. Little merchant man. Yeah, there we go. One, two, three, and that counts as an interrupt attack. Is 
And then that third one. Boom, 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 boom. Um. want to get there was other stuff that I wanted to do before coming up here more black water debris It does look like my elixir are slowly regenerating. my counter exactly pausing between attacks enables a counter attack to be performed costs 30 pure blood if successful puts the enemy into a weakened state and Benito will move closer normal attacks can return some of the enemy's ranged attacks I feel like I should focus on trying to execute that man just donked on me yeah block more asshole hitting beneath I'll beat your ass okay so going around this would have brought us right up here anyway and all we did was take a, a shortcut we did the merchant and then we went up and did that and then did that and then dropped. Is there a I'm trying to find like a kick down. Kickdown's right here, dude. I was so close to it. Oh my god. And this was like, if I remember, this is like right next to our. Uh, where's it at? I know the the thing is like really close to us. There's the uh, the waterfall. I think it's just like this way. Yep, there it is. Beautiful. All right. Well, this seems like a good spot to wrap up. Um, this area is pretty big. But we will rest up here, uh, climb back up, and continue in the next episode. So stay tuned. I'm going to go through and um, take a look at stuff, all that. And then we will resume soon enough. I'll see you all then.